Hi everyone, welcome uh, to this, basically it's a short video, well hopefully it'll be short, I know I can blather a wee bit, but anyway it's a, just this month, February 1983 I started Time Flies, which is the anniversary, 40 years of Time Flies, so, which is a, I never ever thought it'd be time for 40 years, like, but anyway there we are. Uh, it certainly flew in as they say uh, and I've enjoyed every minute of it and and as I said before in fly tying you never stop learning to tie uh, there's always a method or a style or something so you never get bored so you just keep tying away as you know I just like tying flies and fishing obviously and there's uh, lots of plans for this year uh, being the 40th as well uh, and this month and in the next two or three months I'll be giving away some extra materials in the monthly draw so I'm going to be talking about that and uh, the first one is basically let me flick over uh, you'll see here uh, on, the, on the chat well, on the screen is the Fully Mill website and the Fully Mill have supported me over the last probably 2016 onwards uh, but at the same time supported me but without tying me up to just using their stuff. Uh, I'm still free to do whatever I like. Uh, I'm not under any control of sign nothing. So basically if I need help or I need some something, uh, basically it works as a we work together if we want to. They just happen to uh, launch fly time materials. Uh, it's a good selection of stuff. So what I'm gonna do is uh, they've allowed me to select some materials to give away in the month, this month's draw which uh, is in the post but anyway there where you can see there there's some of the materials they have uh, there's a few bits and pieces here's obviously dubbins uh, I've got a, I like the dubbins and obviously the hooks and beads so anyway that's that's some of the stuff I'm going to be giving away uh, in this month's draw also um, I'm very lucky enough that I've obviously I know quite a few people in the, the fishing world and a uh, good friend Ian, Ian Gordon, who's a salmon fish, salmon angler, he's, lots of things he's done over the years, and Stevie Munn from Ireland. And they have designed rods for a, for a company called Cadence. And last year I got hold of a couple of their rods actually. I got hold of a trout rod, a 9 foot 4 weight, which is an absolute perfect rod for a, the river. It's a good dry fly, good nymph rod for me, as well as wet flies. It's got a nice action. Uh, nine foot four weight, so it's uh, absolutely brilliant. And uh, but I actually gave away my rod uh, in one of the draws. Uh, just to, I mean, it's obviously to help promote that. It's a small company, but with a really good product. And uh, and as far as I'm, it's uh, it's it's one of the cheapest rods uh, in the market for the, the quality is amazing. Uh, and I'm not saying that just because the company is there, but it's I wouldn't say it otherwise. And again, I'm not under any. I've got to do this, I've got to do that, I'm doing it in my own free will, so, and I've actually got two of the rods uh, I've got sitting here, um, I've got my, my 10 foot 6 weight, and uh, which is obviously, I'm going to use this up in locks, I just need the extra height in the back cast from the banking, uh, um, still swearing with the 5 weight, uh, I'd prefer the 5 weight, the 6, I mean, uh, it just depends, I haven't had a cast with this one yet, so I'm going to give them that a go, I've actually got the lines, they do the lines to go with it, and it's mainly floating lines. Uh, but is this the six weight? I've got the two, this is the six weight uh, line that they do. And uh, again, and they're, they're great prices. I mean, uh, if I go into their website, I'll just show you. They flick over to my, um, hopefully it's filling my old, to the, there's their website there. Now, I've always got Gordon's got his double handed rods, and I've got Stevie with his single handed rods. And this is the ones I've got here, uh, and as well as I've, I mean, if you go into uh, Stevie's, you'll see there's actually quite a few uh, rods here. I mean, the 10 foot range is like, uh, I've got, God, I don't know how many rods I've actually got. Uh, one, two, three, four, seven rods. Uh, so basically, I mean, you've got from a two weight up to an eight weight. I mean, there's not many companies. Companies will do that with one one length. They'll have a 
varied number of lengths and so on, which is pretty amazing. Like uh, to get a company that does that, and then if we go to back to uh, Ian Gordon, if we look at Ian's uh, selection, now it's the micro spay that that I'll be giving away in the, this month's draw, as well as I mean a choice anyway. So that's the micro spay again. You have a from a three four weight up to an eight nine. The one I actually use is the seven eight, uh, which is a lovely rod to use. A nice, nice and light, suits the grill. So and it'll handle a big fish as well. It's a great summer rod for me. But so in the draw, they'll, you have the choice of a micro spay or the trout rods. Uh, so that you, as I say, you'll get a choice. But we can always sort that out as the as the, as the month goes on. And all as well as the fly tying materials. So, but anyway, the the rods itself. Uh, I mean, they're well done. Well made. You've got a good. I mean, that's my other rod here. Is my nine foot four weight. It's just a it's a dreamy rod to use. It's great for dry flies. I mean, I was uh, again. I was thinking of the five weight, but I got I got the four weight, and then I was really chuffed that I did, because it worked out to be a great rod. So be the nine foot four. I'd, I'd love to. Uh, sorry, five. I would love to give that a good go, uh, but we'll see. And again, they do the line, the float line to go with it, and they're all color coded to suit. So this is the four weight version to suit the suit that rod. So anyway, as I say, it's just a a, a basic uh, what do you call it? It's just a wee video just to talk about it and to let you know that some of the things that's happening. And the other thing I'm going to be doing. Obviously, he's getting ready for the season. I've got all the cameras ready. I've got my GoPro with the few bits on it, and I've got the harnesses, and I've got everything. So, hopefully, the season will go well. And I mean, it's all down to the the monthly draw and the donation, uh, the donations I get throughout the month. I, I, I invest it all. I, I try and spread. I try and give something back as well. I don't like taking something for nothing. I like to make sure. I'm giving as much back uh, in some way, whether it be filming uh, or obviously the chance of getting a rod, materials, anything. I'll try my best to make sure it, it, it pays and uh, it promotes the channel and, and fly fishing. I mean, that's what it's all about. So basically, as I say, it's just a quick video talking about this month, uh, 40th year, 40 years of time flies. And then the last month's draw, I'll be giving away one of the cadence rods. Uh, as well as some fly tie materials from Fully Mill. So, if you want to take part, it's basically simple. Um, I've got a, on my YouTube channel uh, homepage, I actually have a, a donation button, PayPal donation button. Now, uh, small donation, anything, it doesn't matter, anything. It just basically go, it allows me then to be able to send a number to you, contact you. Uh, and basically then at the end of the month, it's always the, the last day of the month at 7 p.m. UK time, uh, I do the, the draw. And it's, it, as I say, a lot of people enjoy it. It gives us a chance to, basically, all the flies that I tie, I, uh, practically everything. There's I, I give away in the draw, and whether it be the, the flies in the video with some extra, as well as a, a box of flies. So, And I'm happy to do that. Uh, I mean, I can scrape a box, I mean... I get I get all the rejects. I threw them in a in a wee tub here, so I do uh, keep them for myself. Um, I've got a couple of dries there, but sometimes they don't make it. Kapal comes in and he had a spare fly, David. So <laughs> so I end up giving them away. But anyway, that's how I have it. I've got these wee wee boxes like this, just to give an idea. Uh, I, I put them in there and I stick them in my waders. So it's my idea of getting a fly. But anyway, I, I don't mind. I've always did it anyway. Uh, much like a gardener, uh, it does everybody's garden perfect, but doesn't do his own. It's the same idea on fly time. But anyway, there we are. So anyway, I hope if you do take part, enjoy it. If you don't, just drop by, keep asking questions. And remember, I'm always looking for something different to tie, because I have a lot of videos now on a lot of patterns. Uh, something with, about history or something like that. Or, Basically a method, a time method within that fly or anything, or even an idea for a fly box because I will be uh, adding to the fly box the ranges uh, of flies that I'm tying. So just any of my message, just punk it down. If I don't answer, I, I always, my wee notepad, I write it down, 
all the ideas here. So uh, don't worry, I, I always watch. Uh, so anyway, thanks for watching the video and uh, until next time.